Well, the time has finally come to replace your trusty old mower. Or perhaps you're looking at buying your first mower. The first thing you'll find is that there's quite a range to choose from. So here are a few of my top tips to help make it easy for you to find your perfect mower match. There's no better place to get started than how you get a mower started. With mowers today, you've got two main choices. There's the traditional cord or pull start engine where you provide at least some of the muscle to turn the engine over. But there are a couple of features you need to be thinking about. Typically you'll find the cord grip on top of the engine, but what you really need to be looking for is easy start features. The Victor Super Mulcher with Ready Start technology has been engineered to be easy to start. No priming, no chokes, just one smooth pull and it starts. And here's a tip to make any pull start easier. Don't just grab the cord and pull. Pull gently until you feel it catch and then pull firmly. The other starting option is key or push button starting. Some Victor mowers use Briggs & Stratton's in-start technology. All you have to do is push a button or turn a key and you're off and mowing. Now that's easy starting. Deck size or cutting width is an important consideration and here there are a couple of angles to think about. First and most importantly is that a wider deck means a faster mow. More grass per pass means less laps of your lawn. The other point is access. If you have a large easily accessible lawn then bigger is better. But if you have a smaller lawn, or a narrow gate or passageway, or you have to lift and carry, then go for a smaller deck size. If you have a large or sloping lawn, you can't go past a self-propelled mower. With these models, the rear wheels are driven by the engine, so you only have to walk behind. No pushing required. Quick, easy and comfortable. The next one to think about is a double whammy. It's about saving your time when you're mowing, and making your mowing more sustainable. Pick a mower that's been engineered for quality mulch mowing and you'll be saving time by not stopping and starting to empty the catcher. Rather than being treated as waste, your clippings are being finely diced and reused, helping to retain moisture. Then they start to convert back to basic organic nutrients. So it's like organically fertilising your lawn and your soil every single time you mow. Mulch mowing is also a perfect way to summer proof your lawn. You can mulch mow pretty much year round, but when it's been wet or it's really cool, then switch back to a catcher. And remember too that size matters. Engine size, that is. To get the fastest, cleanest, most consistent cut, especially on thick, wet or fast growing lawn, then you need a larger, more powerful engine. You'll find there's a premium quality Briggs & Stratton engine to suit every need and every lawn. And last but not least, maintenance. All mowers do need a little bit of TLC, but go for one that has lower maintenance needs. So there's just a few of my tips to help you make your perfect mower match. Oh, and one last tip. If you want to find the largest range of Aussie born and bred mowers, then check out what Victor have on offer. They have your every lawn care need covered.